All right, two things. First of all, let's just stop talking about future palaces before people start saying more stuff that I don't want them to that I can't really comment on because I don't want to say it in the video for people who are seeing this for the first time. I know that there are a handful of people on YouTube who did not watch my OG Persona 5 playthrough that uh, are watching this. So I don't want to say anything that's going to be a super explicit spoiler for them. Second of all, my logic is the owner of the palace should be the thing related to the sin, etc. I think the final boss is what they base the sin off of. So, you know. But let's, we're done talking about it. What's with the big group? Good evening. We were thinking about putting together plans for our summer. Hmm. Is that a new face I see? It's nice to meet you. My name is Makoto Nijima. I hope we're not being a bother. She's our student council president. Nijima. Is something wrong? Yeah, your sister was rude to Coffee Daddy, and now we have to execute her. Sorry. No, it's nothing. A student council president, eh? <laughs> I'm stunned. I hope he's not causing you too much trouble. I'm Sojiro Sakura, but everyone just calls me boss. By the way, that was addressed to you. Uh, this old man will get going and leave you kids be. All right, the store's all yours. We have late-breaking news on Medjit, whose notoriety rose since their statement the other day. Just moments ago, a new message has been released on their website. They have announced their victory over the Phantom Thieves. Medjit also warns any Japanese citizens who praised the Phantom Thieves to stop doing so. We will report any further actions by Medjit as they arrive. Oh, come on! It's in English! Let me see. The Phantom Thieves remain silent at our question. This proves that we are just. Yeah, that's how that works. I, it must be great for, like, younger, if some younger kids play this game or something, to be like, what do you mean it's in English? You're speaking English, etc., etc. People of Japan, wake up. You must not worship the Phantom Thieves. What? That's bullshit! Keep listening. We will discipline any who worship them. The punishment is the confiscation of possessions. We are Medjed. We are unseen. We will eliminate evil. That's what it says. What does that all mean? They're saying that they'll target sympathizers of the Phantom Thieves. Confiscation of possessions, hmm? Perhaps bank accounts or personal information? Either way, it won't be anything pleasant. Why the hell are we being singled out? Perhaps all they care about is labeling the Phantom Thieves as crooks. But all this wouldn't have happened had the Phantom Thieves not existed. That's complete bullshit! Talk about a troublesome organization that we've been targeted by. Isn't there anything we can do? It certainly can't do anything about this on our own. Hey, so what's this letter about? You don't need any more trouble. It's rare for you to get something like this. A calling card? Anything else in there? Who's this from, anyway? There's no stamp on it. Someone must have directly dropped it into the mailbox here. Could it have been Alibaba? That reminds me. He did mention something about preparing the necessary tool. Don't tell me. Is this what he was talking about? What the hell's going on here? All we can do at the moment is wait for Alibaba's orders. Let's brace ourselves and stand by. In case anything comes up. Oh dear. Freely started turning the heat up on the forum, put a special post up and everything. Showdown between the Just Phantom Thieves and the global organization... Uh, yeah, organization Medjet is here. Reaction of... 
I cannot read. Reactions have been great too. Everyone is really engaged. So far, most of the comments have been pro Phantom Thieves, most likely because of what happened in the Kanashiro case. Those on the other side say Medjet are hackers of justice, but there's nothing resembling justice in what they do. Someday, I want the whole site to be filled with pro thieves comments. I'm looking forward to when that day finally arrives. Ah, you want to make an echo chamber, so basically Twitter. He can look forward to whatever he wants. We have no means of striking back against Medjet. We're gonna be in deep trouble if we don't do something. Literally, like he inserts the phone into his thigh. First that Alibaba character and now a blank calling card. What's going on? Please. Hey, hey. Yes! Yes! Fertilize! Fertilize it! Give me the kindness. That should do it for a while. Has that gotten my kindness up to where it's almost rank four? Please. Kindness. Kindness. Still not at the final step. Curses. Where did you get the Rize poster? I think it was a gift from On when I hung out with On once. Alright, we can't go anywhere else. This time we'll play a video game. No crossword. Wow. Do -do -do. I did not mean to talk to the cardboard box. Uh, what DVD do I have right now? Could get my charm up even more. What do I want more right now? Charm or guts? What do you need rank 5 guts for? Is rank 5 guts just for finishing a Y? We haven't even started a Y yet, but we're about to get locked out of Makoto. So actually, let's watch this instead to keep getting closer to rank 5 guts for Makoto. You're the most unremarkably attractive woman to ever work fashion, Betsy. God, I love you. Yeah, I hear that. Wait, what did you say? Looks like this woman's ex-lover is rediscovering why he loved her in the first place. It'll definitely go better the second time. Hmm. See, looks aren't everything for humans, what did I tell you? Yeah, I mean, that's what humans like to say. Oh. We finished watching Not So Hot Betsy, huh? Yeah, give me the charm. Hmm. Give me those three points. Gotta get this rank five. Okay. Let's go return the DVD soon. I will oh. definitely forget to. As I typically do. Why haven't the Phantom Thieves said anything? Well, how are the Phantom Thieves going to say something without giving themselves away? Having your money stolen sounds terrifying. It's unsettling not knowing what they're going to do to us. They're declaring their victory? What does that mean? Really wish they'd stopped that. Good morning. <sighs> Every day is so hot. I empty my water bottle so fast. By the way, summer break is coming up. Could I ask what your plans are, Senpai? What, what about you? What are you doing for summer break? So, anyway... I'll be mostly doing training with the gymnastics team. And if I have free time, I'll be doing self-training. You are so dedicated. Would you like to join me, Senpai? Whenever you're available would be fun. Oh, the train is here. Let's get going then. Please text me to hang out with you more. I've got to get you like three more ranks up. And I don't think you're even ready to rank up yet. Hey, your phone's buzzing. Can Alibaba not text me at a time that isn't during school hours? Never mind, it's Ryuji. Can Ryuji stop texting me during school hours? Did Alibaba message you? Mm, it's just Ryuji. Nothing? Let us know ASAP if he tries to get in touch with you, okay? What a fake out! Ryuji again? He just never shuts up, does he? You're one to talk, cat. Good day. Good day to you, too. You know, th there's no need to be rude here. We can be friendly. We're respectable people. Ah, you responded today. Once again, I am Alibaba. You are the leader of the Phantom Thieves, correct? That's right. Hmm, I appreciate your honesty. I take it you received the calling card? So it really was from this guy. Are you at school right now? 
Yeah, I'm in class. Ah, you're a surprisingly diligent student. Now then, I've prepared the calling card for you. When are you going to steal it? Steal from who? What do you mean by that? Aren't you able to steal a heart as long as you have a calling card? Tell him. We need the name of the target. I need a name. A name. Is your heart thievery truly impossible without such inf information? It is. I see. Suppose past calling cards did have names on them. One moment. Very well, I'll tell you. I believe their name was Futaba Sakura. If you fail in this mission, I will expose your identity to the world and to the police. All right, this just got really serious all of a sudden. Well, then I'll be counting on you. We shall speak again after the change of heart. Wait, who is Futaba Sakura? Can't find the account to send a response to. All I get back is an error message. So he threatened you, then just took off? Yeah, really rude. After we had such a nice exchanging of pleasantries, like saying good day and everything. Sakura? I feel like I've heard that name before. In any case, we should let everyone know about this. We're gonna get reported if we don't do this? What the hell? Futaba Sakura? Wasn't Sakura... It's boss's last name! Does he have any family? Does he? For reals? How laid back are you? Wouldn't you normally be introduced at least? I mean, you are living at his place. Well, his situation does make things difficult. The calling card was delivered to Boss's house. It'd be more natural to assume this is all related. One of the reasons for that is because Alibaba mentioned nothing about which Futaba Sakura. Perhaps he thinks that the name alone is enough. That makes sense. I believe it's adequate for us to think that this is the doing of someone close by. I see. I don't know how Alibaba got a hold of his smartphone information. However, since he's ordering us through chat, I do feel as though he's taunting us. You mean, this might just be a prank? I mean, look at his demands. Pay me if you don't want me to leak who you really are. That I'd understand. But he's telling us to steal someone's heart without explaining why. So we're being tested. Regardless, I think we should ask Boss about Futaba Sakura once. That's probably for the best. There's nothing else we can do at the moment, and Chief might have an idea on what this is about, too. I'll check the school's roster just in case. We must make sure Boss doesn't figure out who we are. We'll have to go about this cautiously. What's up? Yeah, who's Futaba Sakura? Why do you know about that? <sighs> it's got nothing to do with you. I'm going home. Make sure you lock up the place. Looks like it's a hit. Oh, I just remembered. Akira, were you, able to, eh, were you able to ask the boss about Futaba Sakura? He didn't want to talk. Could there be a reason as to why that was? Halibaba might be our only hope of defeating Medjed. Wish we could get some info about Futaba out of boss. But trying to force it out would probably have the opposite effect. To be honest, I owe a great deal to both boss and Akira. I don't wish for this to be a source of discord between them. Yeah, I know just what you mean. It's probably best to wait for boss to bring the subject up himself. Yeah, don't be rude to Coffee Daddy. People are talking about uh, Sakura from Naruto because they brought up the name Sakura. All I'm going to say is, is me and my... Dang it, how dare you not be unhealthy the very next day. Me and uh, Michael Sly and RTK, we did a top 10 like most hated characters in anime. Sakura Haruno from Naruto was my second most hated character in all of anime. Absolutely hate her. Wish she wasn't in the show. 
Or at least Kishimoto had written her, like, way better. But unfortunately, he wrote her terribly because she sucks. So, there's that. This is coming from someone whose favorite anime of all time is Naruto. Uh, wait, wait, wait. I can't go anywhere, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're going to, uh... We're going to... I didn't get a chance to switch out the DVD, so we're going to play the video game. Who's number one on your list? Uh, friggin' What's-Her-Face from Code Geass. Uh, Nina, I think is her name. I believe. She is terrible. I would argue that neither Hinata nor Sakura are, like, very useful in Naruto. The only thing Hinata ever did was buy time for- was All she did was get Naruto mad so that he went into Six Tales Against Pain. That's all Hinata ever did that was worth anything. And then, uh, the only thing Sakura ever did was stop Naruto from dying after the Nine Tails was taken out of his body. Other than that, they never really do anything that's, like, really useful that couldn't have just been done by someone else in the show. Easily. So, like, they're just worthless. <laughs> Basically. But yeah, Nina from Code Geass is, like, the worst character I've ever seen in any anime ever, and I wish she didn't exist. But I also hate Sakura and wish she didn't exist either. Uh, let's play a game. Time to get gutsier. Okay. Start up Star Forneus. Well then. By the way, didn't you read that secret technique book? Apparently there's a way to shoot double lasers from your ship to make things a little easier. I'm absolutely gonna cheat. 100%. What's the point in reading the book if I'm not going to cheat? Hmm? Why am I- wait a minute, I should be reading this. That's a new type of enemy. Make sure you aim carefully before you try to shoot it down. Good, good. Looks like you're on track to beat it. Ah, oh, there aren't many enemies left. Is the boss coming up? There it is! That's a lot of tentacles. Like, man. So many tentacles. Like, Japan levels of tentacles. Can't hit the core without destroying them first. Do you think... Oh, I wasn't prepared for this. He's done it. What about killing the Tailed Beast drug guy from Sakura Hidon? That's like past Shippuden. I ignore everything that's after Shippuden because Naruto should have ended with Shippuden. Boruto is bad. And like, it's it's just all trash. They just made it worse and worse. Like the fact that you said the words Tailed Beast drug, I'm already like, this is the stupidest thing I've ever heard. That's beyond dumb. So that's just a load of crap and I don't care. Nice, you destroyed all the tentacles in the core too. Eased on hey. it. I actually managed to beat the level. I'm impressed. Nice. Secret technique book helped, huh? Always looking for the most efficient way to do things. I admire that about you. Give me those points. The guts. Does that include Naruto the Last? Yes, absolutely. I could not care less about the last movie. Do not care at all. Yeah. The only good thing to, like, ever come out of Boruto existing is every time they animate a fight scene where... Adult Naruto and adult Sasuke fight together, like side by side. That's the only good thing at all to come out of continuing Naruto past Shippuden. It should have just ended in Shippuden, 100%. It was a mistake to go any further, in my opinion. It's getting late. Let's head to sleep soon, okay? You don't remember who Nina is, Lone Wolf? Nina no. Nina is the character that the uh, the the table kun meme comes from. That is absolutely awful. It's literally like the worst it's the worst single scene in any anime I've ever seen. Actually awful. Tomorrow's the end of the first semester, but we still got all this lame shit coming up. If you don't take care of this lame shit, you can kiss your summer vacation goodbye. Oh yeah, about this Futaba Sakura girl. If she's related to Boss, think people living nearby would know about her? That's some keen intuition coming from you, Ryuji. You should have made use of that on your exams. Cat Ryuji has been like smarter than you for most of this game, and that's just sad. Oh, I never want to think about exams ever again. Anyway, asking around in your neighborhood might be the fastest way to figure this shit out. And again, I doubt it'll be that easy. It never is. <laughs> Summer vacation starts the day after tomorrow, but don't forget. 
There's an urgent assembly on Monday. We'll be taking attendance. There's been an unusual number of strange incidents this year. Don't do anything stupid over break. Got it. Don't go someplace shady like the red light district. And don't go to the beach after dark. Want to go to the beach? Want to jump in some cold water? <sighs> Seems like we won't be having a, we won't be having fun on our summer break for a while. 